quickly about the closure of the downtown San Francisco Macy's. As Crown Force Teresa Stasio reports at the Macy's in Walnut Creek, the news was met with sadness and relief. Their local store is so far not on the hit list. On a sunny Tuesday afternoon, foot traffic into this Macy's at Broadway Plaza was bustling. Do you still shop at Macy's? Yes. What do you buy? Perfume mostly. Shoppers like Cherie Hicks say that they enjoy venturing into the brick and mortar store, but they also expressed surprise and shock to hear about the closure of 150 Macy's department stores and the planned sale of the behemoth Macy's building in downtown San Francisco, leaving its future murky. It's kind of sad to uh, see all the Macy's in San Francisco is closing because it's followed by first it was Nordstrom and then it's Macy's. Actually, it is six stories of fabulous. It's sad. Others had harsher words to share. I don't go to San Francisco anymore. I do. Why? It's not clean enough anymore. And that I don't feel safe there. Yeah. San Francisco Mayor London Breed blamed the closure on several factors, such as the rise in online shopping. However, many stepping into the store say it is more complicated than that. I just know that the Macy's in on that creek is smaller than the one in San Francisco. The one in San Francisco looks like the Macy's of old time, you know, where it's elegant. Uh, and it's a shame because I love the city and I grew up there and I just moved out here two years ago, and I miss the city still. But what I miss in the city isn't existing anymore. Now, is it somebody's fault? I don't know. It's not clear what stores will be shuttered. A spokesperson with Broadway Plaza told Cron 4 News they have not received any notice of any changes to their Macy's. In Walnut Creek, Teresa Stasio, Cron 4 News.